Okay, I was so emotionally discombobulated from this episode that I forgot about the Collector. They seem to be trapped in the void between dimensions, maybe in a bubble dimension of their own. So terrifying thought, you know, Titan's blood can make a portal. Fun cartoon theory number one, can King himself become a portal? And two, does his blood allow him to travel between worlds without a portal? Like, maybe someone has already thought of this, but this is the first time I'm thinking of it, so here I go. For the first theory, the Collector possessing someone has been on my mind so much that the possibility of King the character becoming an object didn't even occur to me. If the Titan Hunters had split him open at the ritual, would that have formed a portal that the Collector could walk through? And then on the second theory, can King walk through dimensions on his own? With the right magic, could he hold Luce's hand and take her home? King is very afraid of losing her, so being able to go get her anytime would be the perfect power for him. In this show's happiest timeline, he gets that power, but I don't know if this show is in its happiest timeline. And technically speaking, I don't even have time to make a video right now, so this is where the video ends.